top of the morning guys how it's going so today we are out here again I'm gonna show you in this video how the simple the simple and the easiest way in my opinion to set up a corner ports I'm gonna show you how to take how to take your measurement the measurement that you need to take from the wall outside the ledge and how to plumb it and get it perfect as it's supposed to be in my opinion let's go on let's just jump right into the video guys so first thing we want to do we want to put up our corner post we want to have at least two nail on both sides this is a seven foot corner post usually a corner post put up by two person it's a small one i can do by myself I'm gonna put it just like so on the ledge. You wanna put it right down there. What want to do guys, we want to get two brick ties. I'm going to explain what I'm going to do with them later on. Keep watching. The brick ties, we're going to bend them. Just like so. We're going to bend this one. And you're just going to tap on it like this. We're going to put it right here. I'm going to explain in a second the reason for that. The reason why I put my brick tie right here because I want to have my brick sitting off the ledge, the concrete foundation, at least an half an inch. Here we want to take the measurement from the, 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 the wall itself. You want to measure four and a half inches. That's where we want our corner supposed to be. This is where we want to put our, 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 our brick, four and a half inches, just like that. That's four and a half. So this is the space that you have here. Is what is later on in case they want to do purging, you could just easily purge it. We don't want to have it flush here or inside of the ledge because the, the purging is gonna come right over and throw you onto your brick. You don't want that. So we're gonna we're gonna sit it right here. Take four and a half, just like this outside. You'll see what I mean in a minute. Let's plumb it up first. Okay, so it's telling me now that it wanna go in. So you want to lift it up your corner post up into here like this and push it in. That's where it's plumb. Let's tighten this one. Okay, so now we want to check to make sure we have our four and a half like I mentioned earlier. The way to do that is to put your lever right onto the wall. Rest it right like that and measure from the level out you, you want to have four and a half inches here okay so here it's telling me that is four and a quarter it's telling me that is four inches so now it's now what you want to do you want to put something bigger okay so that's where it's from now tighten it we've got to plumb the next side Sometimes you gotta use something bigger. In my case, now I'm gonna use something more bigger at the back around here instead of the brick ties. Reason for that, we wanna have four and a half inches from, from the wall over. So here, now it's four and a half. That's what we want. So we're gonna use a piece of, so here, as you see, the ledge here is a little bit less than this side here, which is three and a half. Here is like three inches. And from the wall out, we wanna have four and a half. Just like so. So this brick tie here is a little bit too small, so we're gonna use a piece of timber. So now you just wanna put a nail inside of it so that it won't move. It won't move. So we're gonna nail it in. 
not that's not going nowhere now. Okay, so now we gotta plumb it up. That's it guys. So here I wanna check to make sure we have four and a half. It's very important to have at least. So this side is four and a half guys. This side is good, it's perfect. Reason why you wanna have four and a half inches. Um, basically, the wall sometimes can be crooked. The top can go out, you don't know. You wanna have a cavity behind the wall, go all the way up. Just in case the wall crooked at the top, you won't run into any difficulty where you have to cut the back of your brick. So always have at least four and a half from your wall out to the hedge of your brick. Major four and a half from this, from the, from the wall out to your brick. Just like so. This way they can forage it later on if they wish to. Okay guys, that's it for this one. Hope you get value from this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe for more upcoming video like this one. We still have a lot of brickwork as you see here. We're building two houses. Um, I thought I'd give you thought I'd give you a short video of how to set up a corner post. My way of doing it. And subscribe for more upcoming video like this one. We upload video twice a week and share it. There's a share button at the bottom there. Just hit on that share button. Share it to your WhatsApp, your Facebook. I truly appreciate that. Share it with your friends. They may see and learn something from it. Until then, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.